Man, what's up YouTube? It's Stuntastic210 back at you with another sneaker review. This time over the Chimera kit, Scotty Pippen, which released a few weeks back. I was able to get a pair off of StockX. Resale actually wasn't too bad, so I was thankful for that. I have been looking out for these for a while, and I'm going to be honest with you, I haven't had no, no reason to buy anything from Nike Basketball. Everything has been Adidas. Adidas has been dominating everything from NMDs to Yeezys to Ultra Boost. I've been completely fixated with runners now, so Nike Basketball kind of took a back seat. And let's be honest, they haven't been to the pinnacle that they were compared to the Galaxy releases of the past. The storytelling has been lacking. The designs haven't been up to par. So a lot of things have just been sitting on the shelves. But when I saw these, these were a must have and it made me spend them coins quick. And when you see the shoes, you're gonna understand why. Now starting off, we got the 33, of course, Scottie Pippen. And getting into the actual shoes, bruh, the mangasm that I got when I first saw these, huge. Basically, Ronnie Fi, he told an amazing story with these. It's a, it's a mixture of beasts, and that's what Chimera stands for. And as you can see, it has a lot of prints. And that's what Chimera was. It was a mythological creature that was combined with various shapes and animals. So as you can see in the actual design of the shoe, you got leopard, you got zebra print, you got tiger print, all incorporated into one and executed brilliantly from Ronnie Fi. And if, you, if you're a huge fan of Kith and Ronnie Fi, you know his collaborations are always on point. He's, he's one of those that always delivers him and Concepts. Anytime they drop a collab, definitely I'm always on the lookout for, for anything that those guys design. And this one, like I said, I had to cop. Now getting into the laces and other aspects of the shoe, I actually got these from Laced Up Laces. The golden and the black just, just adds more to the aesthetics of the shoe brings out and incorporates everything all into one so huge thanks to laced up laces uh actually finding these and matching up perfectly with these uh and as you can see it comes with the kith logo on the tongue as well as the kith logo in the rear but overall this shoe was just extremely well executed and it had the storyline that had been lacking from Nike basketball for so long and Adidas has really just been serving competition to Nike lately and that's just just one of those things that's just a hard fact no alternative facts like you see it baby like you got KDs you got LeBron's they're still sitting on the shelves Jordan's who would have thought Jays would still be sitting? They're at the outlets now. I'm telling you, Nike basketball has got to revitalize and come back and bring back that essence of what they had at the pinnacle of their releases, which was the Galaxy, which every everybody was craving and salivating over. That's not what it is now. And I got, I got to be honest, man, Adidas has just been, I've been, giving them all my coins lately. I'm telling you, they're not disappointing. Their designs are on point. Their storytelling has been, been up to par. They've been getting there. And they, they see that. They're coming for Nike hard. And the consumers see that as well. So, like I said, I just want to give Ronnie Fi a huge thanks for creating these, bringing me back to Nike basketball. It's been a minute. So, Make sure you check out the pics. I got them on my social media. Stuntastic210 on Twitter, IG, and Snapchat. Make sure you like, share, favorite, subscribe. I appreciate y'all checking out the vid. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.